Hey guys, how's it going? In today's video, I'm going to be showing you where all four Joy Toys are inside of Cyberpunk 2077. So as you see on this map, this is your apartment, your starting apartment. Cross that bridge and you'll hit Cherry Blossom Market. Cherry Blossom Market is where you have the two cheapest Joy Toys and probably, in my opinion, the best ones in the game. Because the other two you have to get at nearly pretty much when you beat the game and they cost $3,000 and they aren't even naked. And there's no fun in non-nudity. So teleport to the Cherry Blossom Market or get to where I am at the map. Go up the stairs and take a right. Follow this green road all the way down. You can already see one of the Joy Toys on the, on the screen right now. This is the male Joy Toy right here. All you have to do to trigger them is to walk up to them, wait a second, and they'll automatically start talking to you. And then you'd hit the one with the kissing emoji on there and you'll start a sex scene with this um, joy toy. So now if we go ahead and walk down this street a little bit more, we're going to end up seeing a female joy toy. Do the same thing, walk up to her and wait a second or two. You looking for some company tonight? And it's up to you whether or not if you want to do it. But these are the two that pretty much everybody knows about. Now the other two require you to actually unlock a mission to get, which I'll be getting more into detail about that. So let's go ahead and make it to the second area now. So this is where you're going to want to be for the other two joy toys that are currently inside of the game. These ones are $3,000 and they're a total ripoff. So what you want to do is go to the Dark Matter Teleport area. As you see, it's just basically in the southern part of Japantown, just straight south from the other Joy Toys. Now, in order to unlock these Joy Toys, what you have to do is you have to make it nearly in-game to where you unlock Carrie's missions. If you don't know who Carrie is, I don't want to spoil anything, so I'm not going to say who Carrie is. Um, for me, the missions that when they triggered for me, I had to do the chipping in quest, then I had to do some quests for Rogue, then I had to do some a bunch of quests for uh, Johnny Silverhand, and then I started doing Carrie's side quests. And it was after like a couple of Carrie's side quests when he brings you to this location, and then it will unlock this building for you. If you try going there beforehand, you will not be able to call the elevator like I just did. So let's go ahead and wait for this elevator now. Think of Skippy humming one of those lovely songs he loves to hum. You only have one option when you get in the elevator. You can already see one of the Joy Toy icons right there. Now once you make it up here, just walk straight like I am and you're going to meet the female Joy Toy. Oh, it's $3,000 for her. I can tell you the first time you talk to her, yeah, she's going to ask you how your day was. You can answer however you want. Sorry, not really interested in now, the other Joy Toy is around the other side of this bar. So let's go ahead and run over there right now. As you see, here's the other Joy Toy. Go ahead, talk to him, and then you can go in and uh, have some a fun time with him if you'd like. And that's basically going to be about it for this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. I hope you like knowing the fact that uh, you're doing the dirty with the same Joy Toy that basically the rest of the population of Night City is also putting their stuff into. So keep that in mind next time you choose to go to these people. That's going to be about it for this video, guys. This is AJ170 signing out. See you guys next time.